looking at the right side of my John Deere 5520. Right inside the right rear wheel well is the hydraulic filter, or the primary hydraulic filter. In the midline, a couple feet in front of the rear axle is the first drain plug. It doesn't normally look like that. I stripped it out years ago and had to weld a, a piece of steel on there to open it. And right behind that, right under the rear axle, is the secondary drain plug. <laughs> Milk! Oh my goodness, look at that shit. Pardon my French. I'll be darned. Oh my goodness. Watch the chunks of green crap come out of here. Oh. Of course, you change out the filter every time you change the fluid. Motors are expensive, filters are cheap. You remove these two bolts and then the cap that covers this, uh, this rear filter. It's a metal screen. I take it out and clean it with a brush and solvent. Eesh. Well, put her all back together, fill her up, and she should be good to go until it happens again, of course. I thought maybe water was getting in through these cracked uh, gear shift covers, so I went ahead and replaced those. But other people online I've read think it's condensation that happens. And I don't know, I guess I'll have to talk to Deer. The, the guys at the shop didn't know what the heck to do with it. It's algae. It's, it needs an algicide, but what algicide you can put in there won't destroy your hydraulics motor. I don't know. I guess I'll have to find out and maybe get back to you on, a, on another video or something. Well, if you've had this problem before and figured out how to fix it, or if you're an expert or a hydraulics engineer, that would be great. Leave your comments below. Appreciate it. Otherwise, if I figure out the solution to it, I'll, I'll let everybody know. The Fritz 4T3, out.